549 now and in our election 2016 coverage this morning, the candidates are in a war of words to try and win over minority and undecided voters with less than 75 days until the general election. Democrat Hillary Clinton and Republican Donald Trump are accusing each other of bigotry. Brian Webb has the latest from New York. Hillary Clinton is accusing Donald Trump of releasing a radical fringe within the Republican Party. He says he wants to make America great again. His real message seems to be make America hate again. In Reno yesterday, she slammed Trump for spreading what she calls racist lies and conspiracy theories. Now, of course, there's always been a paranoid fringe in our politics, a lot of it arising from racial resentment, but it's never had the nominee of a major party stoking it, encouraging it, and giving it a national megaphone until now. Trump tried to beat Clinton to the punch on racism claims. To Hillary Clinton and her donors and advisors, pushing her to spread smears and her lies. Remember these three words, shame, on you. Besides bashing Clinton, Trump continues to clarify his evolving ideas on immigration. He admitted to CNN's Anderson Cooper last night that it would be impossible to deport all of the estimated 11 million undocumented immigrants living in the U.S. No, there's not a pass. There is no path to legalization. Talk about Unless taxes, people identity. leave the country, well, when they come back in, if they come back in, then they can start paying taxes. So Trump will court Hispanic voters today in Las Vegas. During that interview last night, Trump also insisted his first priority continues to be to build a border wall and deport lawbreakers who are living in the country illegally. It's now 551.